mother, a father, a daughter, or a son, a teacher, a farmer, a construction worker, or a student. No one is exempted, and just like me, I am all the amazing things that you see, but there's something that you don't. Oi, ra kaka ayo, nara nas ni mong ulo. Saan po'y raportay ka ba'y? Mas dagan pa gani kung ipublima kaysa ni mo? No, this is not just the mood, nor is it just a bad day. And no, just because you don't see it doesn't mean it's not real. What do you do when you feel like screaming but no one seems to hear you? Mental health, our emotional, psychological, and social well-being that affects how we think, feel, and act. We all have mental health, and we all deserve the availability of help when we need it in times of anxiety, depression, and all the other conditions from the mental health condition spectrum. Since the National Center of Mental Health launched its pandemic hotline last 2019 until May 2020, the center has recorded a total of 6,905 calls. How about those unreported? Those who have no idea that suicide hotlines exist. Those who do not know where to ask for help. Last July 2021, the WHO said in a statement that the mental health impact of the pandemic will be long-term and far-fetching. Everyone is affected in one way or another. Do you know what's even sadder? Patients with mental health disorders are two times as likely to die from COVID-19 patients. Diagnosed or not, one can easily mask or hide what they are going through. Although suicide hotlines are there, not all are aware and have access. And that's why it's very important for us to check on our friends, family, and the people around us. You may ask, what can I do? The answer to that would be, a good listener or not, be there for them. Let them know that you care, that they are not alone. When severely needed, help them go and visit a mental health professional in your locality. Don't shut them down. Listen. Just listen. Sometimes, all we need is somebody's empathic presence. Love them for all that they are, including their mental health condition. Sometimes, some things won't make sense, and that's okay. COVID-19 kills, but insensitive words kill in a second. As we continue to fight this crisis, as we go on working behind screens, let us remind ourselves to always be kind. To always choose kindness. Pause. It's okay to rest as a listener because you matter too. Stop the stigma. My mental health, your mental health, our mental health matters.